Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I want to share with you this beautiful call. Uh, I want to use this turtleneck. This is back side and this is front side. You can use also, not fold it like that. Uh, you can see my photos and videos from beginning of my video. I hope you like it. It's so simple. I use middle thickness. Uh, my um, yarn it's not has any label but it's multicolor and i love its its color i think it's uh shanmayer uh, brand is shanmayer but i couldn't find its uh, color number you can see its thickness i think it's three and i use four uh, five millimeter hook in that cold part here and this neck part, I change my hook and I use 4mm hook. I give all the details in the video, but if you have any questions, please leave me comments and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I want to give you measurements. Its total length, front side is... It's 20 inches. and 50 cm and the uh, neck part is nearly 18 cm 7 inches if you want to make it a more big neck you can crochet more rounds I crochet here 25 rounds and you can fold it like that I want to use it if you're ready we can start to crochet our beautiful and so simple call with turtleneck granny call let's start crochet we start our uh, call with uh, granny part here after we finish this granny part then add its neck part I will show you uh, I use 5 millimeter hook with this granny part I will use 4 millimeter hook that neck part first of all make a magic ring then grab my yarn one two three chains count as my first double yarn over insert into same hole grab my yarn pull through to pull through to make double crochet yarn over make one more double crochet here totally I have three double crochet chain two yarn over and make three more double crochet in the same space one two three then pull that little yarn tightly and close this hole and take these two yarns together chain one two and three then turn my work yarn over and make my increase insert into the first stitch and add here two more double crochet one and two then yarn over come to center not make any chains make here three double chain two in the same chain two space make three double more one two three yarn over come to last double stop and make here three double crochet one two and three chain three and turn your work you will always increase your shawl from beginning, center and the finishing point. So I add in the same first stitch two more double crochet, one and two. So I have here totally three double crochet. Yarn over, come to between of these three groups here, not make any chains and make here three double crochet. 
yarn over and come to center make three double chain two and three double yarn over come to between of these groups make three double yarn over not make any chains come to last stitch stop and make here three double crochet one two three it's as granny shawl as same as if you want to make a granny shawl you will keep repeat always this third row one two three chains turn my work insert into the first stitch and add here two more double so I have here three double crochet I make my first increase yarn over not make chains but if you uh, feel it's tight you will add here one chain and insert that between of these three groups make here three double come to next group make three double get that I come to center always same make three double chain two and three double come to next space not make chains make three double come to next space make three double and come to last stitch don't forget we start with three double we finish the row with three double and make our last increases chain three and turn your work always start in the first stitch make here two more double crochet and complete here three double crochet then come to next make three double come to next three double come to next three double come to center three double chain to three double make your increase first stitch center and the last stitch you will keep repeat that I will keep repeat mine and uh, complete after turn to you how much centimeter I crochet I will tell you I complete and turn to you I grow up my shine shawl until I have I will give you measurements now my width is 60 centimeter here you can see that sixty centimeter and it's equal to nearly twenty four inches now we will get two sides together now I will join two sides here insert my hook join two sides together chain three and count as my first double yarn over and we can see here we have a post here we have a, have a stitch have a post have a little stitch I will make one double in the post one double in the stitch one double in the post one double in the stitch if it comes so tight you can add more uh, doubles here okay I will turn all around this this width part of my shawl little call turn all around after turn to you I come to end turn all around this width with double crochet now I want to add here this joining point one more and insert into the top of first 
chain 3 and join with a slip stitch. Chain 1 and not count yarn over insert into that the first double as front post. Grab my yarn, pull through to pull through to make one front post double crochet. Yarn over insert the next stitch back to front then back. Grab my yarn again, pull through to pull through to make back post double crochet. Then make one front post. Make one back post. One front post. One back post. I will turn all around with one front post, one back post. Then come here and join with a slip stitch. And after these rounds, make front post on the front post, back post on the back post. I will keep repeating uh, several rounds after turn to you and I will tell you how much centimeter and how many rounds I crocheted with one front post, one back post. I complete and turn to you. I complete my calls neck part. I crocheted totally 25 uh, one, front, one front post, one back post stitch and I want to measure it it's totally 18 centimeter if you want you can uh, crochet more rounds and you have get more centimeter and it's equal to 7 inches I want to use it as turtleneck like that I hope you like it it's so simple call and so beautiful I love it very much you can see my photos and videos beginning of the video if you have any questions, please leave me comments and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can reach me on Instagram, on Facebook, on Pinterest and on Etsy as the same name crochet with Gigi. Hope to see you in new videos. Have a nice day. Bye bye.